Hey guys, welcome back to Zone Rule 16. I am your host, Javon, and today we're back with a brand new little setup video. Let me show you how to set up the Xenia emulator, otherwise known as the Xbox 360 emulator, on your PC. Now, you know I do these how to videos very quickly, so we're going to be moving at blazing speeds here. I'm already on the site, the Xenia.jp. This is where you're going to download the master file. I've already downloaded it actually, and I'll have that link in the description below for you. So, once you download that, you'll simply go to where it is. Extract the file with WinRAR or 7-zip, either one is fine. Now, the Xenia emulator is actually really easy to run because there's not there's nothing else to it. You see, I just clicked on it just like that, and it came up. Now, if you already have uh, your controller configured, you should go watch my video on how to set up any controller. That'll also be in the link down below. You need to click on the Xenia emulator because the config file it generates is what you'll be able to change your settings with. Because apparently, you can't change them otherwise. <laughs> So we're gonna go down. I only I leave everything on. This is only for like you change this to one if you're running arcade live games. But other than that, I change nothing on this. I left everything the same except for VSync. Now under GPU you'll find VSync where we simply disable that. If I can find it eventually. I bet I should have. There it is. And we turn it to false. Once that is put as false, that means that the game will run uncapped. So we're going to do a quick game real fast just to show you guys it performing. What is that? Google update? I don't have time for your Google update. I'm going to show you Gears War Judgment. I just did a video on this, so I'll show you Gears of War Judgment real quick. It's preloading the shaders and it'll launch into the game and we'll get into some gameplay really quick. But that's it basically if that's what you wanted to know. That's how you deal with the Xenia emulator. There's not much else to it at this point in time. Everything is in the config file and I wouldn't change much. It does take a minute if you've played the game like a lot. I've played Gears of War Judgment on this so it does take a bit to preload all the shaders. But that makes it a more stutterless experience which is awesome. Okay so as you can see the game is launching right now. Um, I don't actually have the capture on. There was nothing to hear me with before, so I hopefully that's fine. And the game comes on fine, see? Now that was how to set up the Xenia emulator on your PC. Uh, I guess I'll show you a slight bit of it, just the gameplay inside. But yeah, the game runs fine. There we go. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Don't forget, please leave a like, comment, share, subscribe, and stick around for more epic content. I'll see you guys next time. And look at that frame rate is gonna hit to 60 just in a second. Perfect. Our mission was to rendezvous. Zinia emulator, guys. Console. Simple as that. But Once again, I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget, please leave a like, comment, share, subscribe, and stick around for more epic exactly content. I do a bunch of these videos wrong, really fast just to get it out there and show you guys how to do it. Sir, without having to wait eight to ten minutes on a video, I'll see you guys next time.